Hello. Currency C Drama greets you. Chinese drama Love Me, Love My Voice EP 13. Bu Shang had arranged to meet Mo Qingxing at the supermarket. She took the initiative to ask her mother to help at the supermarket. Bu's mother got her daughter was becoming more responsible, but Bu's father remained suspicious, believing that unusual things could lead to trouble. Bu Shang, sensing her father's concerns, quickly pretended not to want to help anymore, relieving his worries. Early in the morning, Bu Sheng arrived at the supermarket, eagerly anticipating meeting Mo Qingqing. She lingered by the window and when she spotted Mo Qingqing, she promptly made an excuse to distract her cousin allowing her to be alone with Mo Qingqing. Mo Qingqing had just finished surgery and missed the cafeteria's meals. In reality he had intentionally used this as an excuse to meet Bu Sheng at the supermarket. He asked Bu Sheng to pick two boxed meals to bring back for Feng Yisong. Bu Sheng offered to treat him, but Mo Qingqing insisted on paying the bill. The relationship between the two was unknown to Bu Sheng's family, and Mo Qingqing wanted to avoid unnecessary complications. Hearing that Mo Qingqing would be busy late into the night, Bu Sheng carefully selected food and planned to deliver it to him at the hospital. Dong Yu insisted on inviting Bu Sheng to watch a movie, but Bu Sheng's thoughts were focused on Mo Qingqing, and she had no time to accompany Dong Yu. Dong Yu had a day off and specifically came to find Bu Sheng because she was a fan of Ching Ching Cai and wanted to get closer to Bu Sheng, hoping to learn more about Ching Ching Cai from her. Bu Sheng arrived at the hospital with the food, knowing that Mo Qingqing was busy. She asked the nurse to deliver the package to Mo Qingqing, claiming to be a delivery person. The nurse, sensing something amiss in Bu Sheng's words, guessed her identity and intentions but decided not to reveal anything. Mo Qingqing was delighted to receive the gotful package, even though Bu Sheng didn't make it herself. Zhou Diaoer's official first day at perfect dubbing approached, and the night before, Wai Guai in the studio had cared for him as if sending a daughter away in marriage. Zhou Diaoer accused Wai Guai of taking advantage of him, but he promised to study hard and adapt. His biggest worry was encountering Ching Ching Cai because he was pursuing Bu Sheng, and his senior brother treated everyone well. He didn't know how to handle such a relationship. On the second day, Guai Guai personally rode an electric bike to drop Zhou Diaoer off at perfect dubbing. She instructed him to call her after work, and she would come to pick him up. Zhou Zheng needed two new roles, and with Zhou Diaoer and another employee in place, he took them directly to the dubbing studio. After briefing them on the details, Mo Qingqing happened to walk out of the room. Zhou Diaoer officially met Mo Qingqing, who introduced himself as Ching Ching Cai. Zhou Diaoer, after a moment of confusion, realized the possibility, as his idol and his senior brother next door turned out to be the same person. Bu Sheng was also at perfect dubbing and upon learning that Zhou Diaoer officially joined the studio she felt happy for him. Mo Qingqing took charge of the kitchen and prepared a delicious meal for the welcoming party. Everyone praised Mo Qingqing's culinary skills, and he took special care to prepare dinner for Zhou Diaoer, knowing his current situation, trying to help alleviate his burden. After dinner, Mo Qingqing solemnly introduced his age and birthday to Gu Sheng. Although it was the first time for Gu Sheng to know, Mo Qingqing had been aware, considering it essential knowledge for a boyfriend. Zhou Diaoer returned to the studio, explained the situation to Guai Guai and the studio head and together, they scolded Gu Sheng for not telling them that Ching Ching Cai was Mo Qingqing. Bu Sheng apologized profusely, assuring them that Mo Qingqing wouldn't hold any grudges over this matter, and they eventually settled the matter. If you like the video don't forget to like and subscribe. Bye bye.